In the walls of our homes, beneath the floors we walk on, and buried under the streets we drive across, runs a silent network that keeps modern life flowing. It doesn't make headlines or steal attention, but without it, everything from running water to proper drainage would come to a halt. It's strong, lightweight, and quietly reliable. Whether it's delivering fresh water to your faucet, carrying waste away from your home, or protecting electrical wires behind the drywall, this unsung material plays a vital role in nearly every building you step into. We rarely see it, yet we depend on it every single day. But have you ever wondered how they're made? What makes them such a vital material in construction, agriculture, and utilities? Let's take a closer look at the birth and breadth of PVC pipes right here on History of Simple Things. PVC stands for polyvinyl chloride, a type of plastic engineered from synthetic chemistry, yet incredibly practical in its everyday form. When molded into pipes, it becomes lightweight, durable, and resistant to corrosion and chemicals. PVC pipes are a cornerstone of modern plumbing, drainage, electrical conduits, and agricultural irrigation. Unlike copper or steel, which can corrode, leak, or react with certain substances, PVC holds its structure over decades. It's easy to cut, connect, and seal, making it a go-to solution for contractors and engineers alike. Its strength-to-weight ratio and long service life make it not only cost-effective, but essential to reliable infrastructure. The manufacturing journey begins with two raw materials, ethylene, often derived from petroleum or natural gas, and chlorine, typically obtained from common salt through electrolysis. These two elements combine to form vinyl chloride monomer, a gas that serves as the foundation of PVC. Through a process called polymerization, these monomers are chemically bonded into long chains, creating polyvinyl chloride resin. At this stage, the material appears as a fine white powder, dry, inert, and odorless. While it doesn't yet resemble anything structural, within this powder lies the potential to become one of the most widely used construction materials on Earth. To give that powdered resin the properties it needs, manufacturers blend it with a cocktail of additives, heat stabilizers to withstand high processing temperatures, impact modifiers for durability, lubricants to ease extrusion, and color pigments when needed. This blend is then fed into an extruder, a machine that heats the mixture and presses it through a pipe-shaped die. As it emerges, still hot and soft, it takes the form of a long, continuous tube. Immediately, it's passed through a cooling bath, where water rapidly solidifies the shape. This stage demands precision. Every pipe's diameter, wall thickness, and roundness must meet exact standards, especially for applications under pressure. After forming and cooling, the pipe is cut into standard lengths, often in 10 or 20-foot segments. But its journey doesn't end there. Every batch must undergo rigorous quality control testing. Pipes are pressure tested to ensure they can handle internal loads, assessed for impact resistance, and evaluated for how they react to chemicals or temperature changes. For high demand environments like municipal water mains or chemical processing, some pipes are specially formulated to handle greater pressure or exposure. Identification markings are stamped along each pipe, indicating its specifications, batch number, and compliance with industry certifications, ensuring traceability and trust in every inch. One of PVC pipe's most widespread and vital uses is in water distribution systems. Municipal utilities rely on vast networks of these pipes to deliver clean, drinkable water from treatment plants to homes and businesses. Its non-toxic composition ensures that no harmful chemicals leach into the water. Additionally, the smooth inner walls of PVC pipes reduce flow resistance, allowing water to move more efficiently and with less energy used in pumping. In residential construction, it has replaced galvanized metal due to its resistance to rust, longer lifespan, and ease of installation. The result? Fewer leaks, cleaner water, and lower costs across the board. 
but water supply is just one part of the equation. PVC also plays a major role in wastewater and sewage systems. Its corrosion resistance allows it to safely carry waste and gray water without degrading under chemical exposure from detergents, waste products, or soil acids. Its slight flexibility helps it absorb minor ground shifts, reducing the risk of cracks from freeze-thaw cycles or seismic movement. Meanwhile, in agriculture, PVC is the workhorse of irrigation systems, distributing water efficiently across fields, vineyards, and orchards. Farmers prize it for its UV stability, long-term reliability in outdoor conditions, and compatibility with pumps, valves, and fittings. PVC pipes also serve as protective channels for electrical wiring. Known as conduits, these hollow tubes shield cables in homes, commercial buildings, and factories. Because PVC doesn't conduct electricity and can be made fire retardant, it's a safe alternative to metal casing. Underground and overhead cabling systems often rely on wide diameter PVC ducts to keep fiber optic and electrical lines safe from moisture, pests, or physical impact. Beyond utilities, PVC pipes find their way into creative and industrial uses, from greenhouse frames and hydroponic systems to furniture, crafts, and even musical instruments like homemade flutes and didgeridoos. Its strength, adaptability, and ease of use know few limits. From raw hydrocarbons and salt to an engineered marvel that crisscrosses continents, the story of PVC pipe is one of innovation meeting necessity. It's not just a plastic tube, it's a modern solution built on chemistry, engineering, and practical need. Every day it carries water to the thirsty, drains waste away from our homes, and shields the wires that power our world. In the grand design of civilization, these pipes may be hidden, but their importance runs deep. So the next time you turn on a faucet or hear water draining away, Take a moment to appreciate the unsung infrastructure carrying the load, silently, efficiently, and reliably. They may not gleam with sophistication or attract much attention, but PVC pipes embody the quiet brilliance of modern engineering. Simple in appearance, yet complex in their journey, these pipes are a testament to how practical innovation shapes the everyday world silently enabling the systems we take for granted. Thank you for watching. If you have suggestions for our next video, feel free to share them in the comments below. We'll be sure to give you an acknowledgement for your contribution. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the history of simple things. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more stories woven through the smallest details.